No high school girl in the country has cleared 14 feet in the pole vault this year, except Desiree Fryer. And she can't even remember how many times she's done it. Uh, about four or five times. Make that five or six times after her performance at the area track and field meet. First attempt, 14 feet, six inches. Fryer vaulted higher than she ever has, clearing 14 and a half feet. <laughs> which will be a new national record if it's accepted. It's great, but don't believe it. I said I don't believe it myself. I'm just like, did, did I do that? Prior to this meet, Desiree already held national high school records for the indoor and outdoor pole vault. And she should win her third straight state championship next month. We can't do a story on Desiree without mentioning her height. So how tall are you? I'm only five foot. It seems a little counterintuitive that someone so short can jump so high, but she does and it's not even close. Devin Rodriguez is her coach and also her stepbrother. He says being tall used to be seen as an advantage in this sport, but not anymore. She's short, but she's really powerful off the ground. She can jump off off the ground, and then when she taps like a gymnast on the high bar, that's where it really connects air awareness with her. The five-foot powerhouse will go to track and field powerhouse Arkansas next year, where she will continue to set the bar higher. From like freshman to sophomore year, I jumped nine inches, sophomore to junior, nine inches, and I've already uh, gotten my nine inches for this year, so now I just going higher.